कहता है सब इस तो so the world number one, Wang Shexian, 21-year-old from Suzhou in Jiangsu province. Wang Jingdeng's gold medalist, of course, uh, against 31-year-old Tina Baum from Denmark. Of course, she won the Singapore Open in 2008 when she was Tina Rasmussen. But on the 29th of May last year, Tina married a uh, few months ago the Danish team physio Martin Bao. So the world number one, Wang Shoshian, World Championship bronze medalist last year, as indeed was Tina Bao. So the two losing semi finalists from the World Championships in Paris. Contesting this semi final here at the Lille Singapore Nation. And she she had. Oh, she's had a great year so far. Here at the finals already, having won three of them. Super Series final. Amazing Super Series and the All England as well. Beaten in the final of Korea. And as far as she is concerned, well, had to play qualifiers in the first two rounds and the second round qualifier is of course the reigning world champion Wang Lin who tragically in that second round encounter re-injured her knee she nearly had surgery on that knee once and then in the quarter final against number eight seed Juliana Schenk from Germany an hour and 23 minutes. She was 17-20 down in the third game, was Wang Shoshian. Saved three match points. And eventually went on to win. Tina Bao. Well, she's down one place in the world rankings, down to number nine. And as I say, won the title here, beating... Joel Meek in the final in 2008. In fact, that was the last time she played here in Singapore. Seeded six in this year's tournament. Ten and four win-loss record for the year. And that is, of course, because she's fighting her way back from injury woes. Missed the All England Championship because of injuries. But she, too, had had a difficult match yesterday in the quarter-final against Chen Xiaoqie of Taipei. Got the first game. When she had two game points in the first, but dropped it 22-24 before coming back 21-17, 21-13 in 53 minutes. So one show she had 30 minutes longer on court in yesterday's quarter-final against Juliana Schenk. players to get ready. Yeah! Former world number one against the current world number one. Just a quick word with coach Morton Frost. And he knows all about being world number one. Asian Games gold medalist. There she is when she was number two. She beat her teammate, the then world number one, Wang Sin in that final in Guangzhou.
right, Tina Bong, Lama. On the left, Wang Xian, China. Tina Bong is served. Lama, play. So the number six seed, Tina Bong, from Denmark. The former over. world number one, former All England champion. One. Of the England title in 2008-2010. Couldn't defend her All England title earlier this year because of injury. And it was her opponent of today who grabbed her title. Love. This is the third meeting between these two players. Previous two occasions against the world number one, Wang Shushian. He won on both occasions. Three, the last time that these two players met was in the quarter-final of the Korean Open earlier this year, the first ever Premier Super Series event and the first ever million-dollar badminton tournament. And Wang Xiaoxian only eventually won 24-22 in the deciding game. Only won on her sixth match point. Service oh. over. One, three. I can tell you, sitting very close to me is another former world number one, Wang Yi Han. Who, of course, was defeated yesterday before the final stage by Yao Ji of the Netherlands. And of course, Wang Yi Han had been the number two seed. And she Ball. is intensely watching this encounter. Got a video camera on it. There's the Chinese coach, Yang She, of course, two-time Olympic champion. Reigning Olympic champion, of course. Positive start One. by the 21 year old Wang Shuxian. She's not fully warmed up, not reacting. Maybe it's a little bit of nerves. No, oh. Seven, one. No, it doesn't look at ease at the moment, does she? Fast on the left, with the Robinson on the right. Two of the former great badminton players from Denmark. out of trouble when the shove has gone past her. Three, and right on cue seven. does precisely that from deep in the forehand corner. Plays the winning smash. <laughs> Suffered the most horrendous injury back in 2005 at the Sibylline Cup Finals in Beijing. Completely ruptured an Achilles tendon. But she came back with Four, more purpose. Seven. Better skills. Lost a bit of weight too. Actually, the injury forced her to become a better badminton player. Oh, 
this line you're in, Miss Judgment from Wang and Kershiak. There's a definite drift in this Singapore Indoor Stadium. Now it's landed clearly in. Really does take her time in between rallies to Sloan Kirchiak. Bound. And I can't help but wonder whether the quarter final yesterday won Shoshian against Juliana Schenk from Germany. Eight, of course, that was the player seven. she lost to at the Sudaman Cup in Qingdao last month. That hour and 23 minute encounter physically. I'm sure that's got to have taken a toll for a long time to run. That's ambitious. I... Oh. You're going to play the cross court net shot. So much easier over taking the shuffle early, taking it as high as possible at the net, and that quite simply was too late. Yeah. There's the physicality coming into play once again. Powerful smash. it was for Wang Shoshian yesterday against Juliana Schenk. I wonder how much it's drained her emotionally as well. Having saved those three match points when 17-20 down in the deciding game. Oh, that's good that was Just wide. And therefore, it is Tina down. And has a two-point advantage at the mid-game interval. One of ten of the last twelve points has this game. Uh, Morton is saying something about the back line. And then it appears to me as if Zhang Nin is saying, come on, you've got to keep get those feet working quickly. Must Court realize one, that she's fatigued seconds. from yesterday's Court match. One. Tape and just crawled over. Oh, that's beautiful. Good judgment from the day. 12, 
10. Oh, this is clever play from Tina Bao. Really working well, Sha Xian pushing her to all four corners of the court. And the Lux with her too. This Seven time the judgment was good. That's the shot of Rob Long. Yeah, what a difference Seven when she's over. taking the shuttle early. I made comments early on in this 11. opening game about how she tried a cross-court netcher from the backhand side taken the shuttle too late. There, she took it early and played the outright winner. Double summer. 12, 15. That's a great smash. Tommy Tomer. 16. 12. Oh, indecision. Goodness me. Oh, she got away with it. I Suddenly changed Bondi. her mind and decided it needed to be played. Just wide, there is a sideways drift as well. And that shuttle just taken out by the drift. And now Tina down just two points away from this opening game. Summit over. Yes, good smash there from one show she had.
know that's wide. Five game point opportunities for the European champion. Yes. Only needed the one. Well, Hopefully having been one Tina seven Bond. down in this opening game, suddenly Tina Bount started motoring. 21-15. The score in the end. 15 minutes of play. And the Chinese coaches have got their work cut out because Wang Chexian, the world number one, looks awfully tired to me, physically and emotionally. Finals day here at the Li Ning Singapore Open event number five on the OSIN BWF World Super Series. Second game, level. And the Park calls for the second game to get underway. The former champion, the 2008 winner of this event, Tina Bound from Denmark, up against the current world number one, Wang Shuxian. play from the tall day took the shuttle early swayed the body one way hit the shuttle another look she comes forward to the net hold and then flick at the last moment sending her opponent in the wrong direction and that's good judgment too pray love hesitation there from Tina Bowne as to whether she should have left the One, shuttle or not. Three. I think she was right to play it, I'm sure it was going in. It was a lovely angle from Wang Shoshian. things that one. Oh. Oh, that's a target. 
shot. Isn't it? Service over. Well, Four. Surprising. Two. Been on court for around 23 minutes last night. Well, this is fascinating because the number of times Tina Bout is forcing Wang Shexian to take it very late in her forehand corner. And the world number one is making one or two errors. She can't get out of trouble. Six, two. Racket. And that to me is much a, a sign of mental fatigue as it is physical fatigue. Such a big match for her yesterday against Service the over. German who beat her in the Sudanan Cup. Three, seven. To beat him for Juan Shoshian. China against Germany, the first of the group matches. First match in the whole of the Sudanan Cup competition. Got play underway in this year's competition. And she lost to the German. And then got dropped from the team. Wang Sing played Eight. instead. And Wang Sing then lost to Sina Nawal in uh, India and therefore for the final. Wang Shoshian was reinstated. deep in her forehand corner when in trouble has the strength to get out of those difficult times in favour of the European champion. I'm sure she had to force the short left, but she wasn't able to put the shuttle away. And changing. And Morton Frost, the two coaches. Morton Frost looks far calmer in his advice. Master tactician is Morton Frost. Part one, 20 seconds. Every rally. Part one, 20 seconds. Make her play the shuffle. Make her turn. And 
and defensively. Like we might see one or two blocks across court. 11 5 play. So 11 5 in the second game, having taken the first. Seven, seven. Six, 11. I was trying to turn the defence on this one from the forehand side. I tried to flick it to the back of the court, but just too long. Court net shot from the backhand side. Nine, it is one of her favourite shots, but at times I wonder sometimes if she overplays it a little. Coaches held their arms aloft as if to celebrate 14 about. The angled smash. Yep, there go the hands. Morton Frost delighted with that. the shot they make it work <laughs> no, 
gap to two points. Uh, deep in the forehand corner again. And again. Yeah. Double cover. It's obviously a tactic that's been 15. talked about and it's been employed Top. exceptionally well. What's that? about but still shouting instructions as indeed he's permitted to do now to coach in between rallies as long as it's called and spoken from the coaches seats at the back of the court yeah, that looks a bit of a dis desperation shot to me from the world number one Moving well now, Tina Bauer, using the full width of the court, deep into the forehand corner, and then immediately smashing cross court towards the backhand of Wang Shuxian. Points were required for the day now to secure her place in her first final of the year. Scrumbling back from injury. Service over. Not one, Churchian. 80. And he's been at world number one for 21 consecutive weeks, 22 weeks in total. And there's a very good reason why she's been why she's been ranked at number one. She's a class player. But at the moment, seeing rallies like that, she has been out Nineteen. Thirteen. Deep forehand corner, exposed, taking the shuttle early at the net before playing that cross-court net shot from the backhand side. That's the key, taking it early. Nineteen. Yeah, just brushing over the shuttle. Not really on balance when she tried to play that smash through the bar. Fifteen. Nineteen. former champion, Tina Baum of Denmark. Yeah. And she's done it. She's recorded her first ever victory over one church run, the world number one. Tina Baum, the 31-year-old from Denmark, is back. She's back to great form. Second time today we've seen world number ones defeated. We saw it in the mixed doubles with John Nang and Zhao Wenlei. 
We've now seen it in the women's singles with Rancho. She had beaten by the 2008 champion here in Singapore. Tina Bao has found her form. She's back from injury. And my goodness, she's playing well. So just confirmation of the score, 21-15, 21-16. And Tina Bao swing to the final tomorrow. And we know that she will play against Wang Sin of China.